Hey guys, we're here at Costco looking at the March deal starting on March 5th. Let's go what's new at Costco, what's on sales this week, this month. Let's go. Interesting. Here is a egg oven. I think someone told me about this. Like, I think one of you guys said about like something about an egg oven in your comments. This is all in one egg cooker. Interesting. 16. This is what it looks like. You can make a double eggs with this. Include egg trays. Omelette trays, poaching trays, $17. Now, Cousinart is on sale. This is my favorite air fryer because look, it has like basket. It also looks, um, it's an oven, so you can use it as a toaster oven. You can also use it as an air fryer. It comes with two basket and one tray. I think mine comes with two tray and one basket. So it's a little bit different, I guess. Um, it's the model, it's a slightly different from ours but I really like this air fryer and this one is currently $40 off right now $150 um, the sale ends March 31st so if you need an air fryer slash toaster oven it saves a lot of space I love this one hey guys I think in my last video I talked about this ceramic nonstick everyday saute pan from Henkel's it's $25 and we actually got one for the mail from Henkel's and I love this this is so good um, only $25 it's lighter compared to the Tramontina one which um, Costco is discontinuing this one is really good quality it comes with a steamer however I burned this pan like 10 times so i'm so glad that i got a henko's it's not as heavy as the tremotina but it's really good i like both of them and um depending on if you can, you can find the tremotina one in your costco but the henko's one is really good um i got one in the mail 25 dollars is a really good price for what you get i used the tremotina one that i have for a whole year i burned it so many times and it's savable but right now it's not as non-stick because i burned it so much but ceramic pan is really good because there's no Teflon coating. I just washed it and we're gonna try it out when I heat up my burritos. So a lot of times I say like I don't like things that have Teflon coating. It's not like anything with Teflon coating you're poisoning yourself, no. Teflon coating only becomes a problem if you scratch your pan or burned your pan. So once you damage your pan, like the Teflon coating is like getting off of the pan is when you need to like switch to a new pan because you don't want to scratch the Teflon coating and the Teflon gets into your food and then the food gets into your, to your body. So if you bought a brand new Teflon pan, that's fine. But the moment that you see any damages on the Teflon pan, um, buy a new one or switch to a different pan because you don't want to accidentally get those into your food. That's what's the problem with Teflon coating. It's not like it's bad on its own. It's when you scratch or damage it. It's nectarine seasons again, which I'm super happy because I love peaches and nectarines. Um, I like the hard ones. Comment down below if you like softer peaches or nectarines or the hard ones. I like when they're hard as raw. This one is $7 for three pounds. $7 for three pounds is a really good price. Grab one of this. Most places sell it for $4 per pound, but this is seven for three pounds. Love that. We're gonna buy some avocados for us and for the baby. Six avocados, six dollars. So one dollar each avocado. Pretty good, it's cheaper. Still half of the price than the normal grocery stores. Those are big avocados, six dollars. Got some organic strawberries. <laughs> Don't see the price anywhere. That's okay. That's okay, I'll still buy organic. The price is not listed. I'll put it on the, on the screen. Got some broccoli as usual. $6 for two pounds organic broccoli. Got some organic raspberries, $8. So always eat healthy. Got some bananas. Green bananas, $1.50. That's pretty cheap. Interesting. There's a new deadly food item called udon noodle salad with dressing. Interesting. Four forty nine dollars per pound. So this is like $10.64. Let's take a look at ingredients, udon noodles, dressing is miso paste, sugar, mayonnaise, oh, they have soybean oil mayonnaise, why don't they use the avocado oil mayonnaise, egg yolk, corn syrup, what? No, I wish they just use sugar, what happened to sugar syrup, chili oil has soybean oil, yeah, this is not healthy at all, I'll put it back, uh -oh. nope, I'm not missing approved. This is what it looks like, new item. 
So this Titan water syringe, this sausage, I always say this word wrong. It's not polish, it's Polish. Polish sausage is on sale, $4.50 off $12.49. This is 100% grass-fed beef sausage. That's pretty good. Like it has really good ingredients, no nitrites or nitrites added, which is pretty good. I, it does taste really, really good. So if you're looking for a sausage item, this is a good one. $12.49 after the sale. The sale ends March 30th. All right, guys, the Reina lasagna is on sale. $4.20 off right now is $10-ish for this whole pack of lasagna. I'm going to buy it. Made with cheese and vegetables. A sale ends March 31st. I'm going to buy it for my husband to take it to lunch to share. $4 off is a really good deal. Reina has really good ingredients. Vegetable lasagna, here we go. Definitely got some carrots and some green beans. A lot of not meat. Yeah, definitely. All right, let's try this out. I think it's just carrots and carrots and green beans. Carrots and sadness. Yeah. Carrots here we go. Here we go. He's not dead yet. Definitely on ten questions. It's on. Though. It's not vegan though, right? Like that's at least real cheese. It's definitely cheese. Okay, that's good. This is a start. I think the noodles taste okay. It needs red sauce for sure. This this sauce. Kind of tastes like tuna casserole to me. It does oh, not taste like lasagna. Well, like you could, it's edible, but I would really want to. The eat Korean it. inspired beef stir fry noodles is on sale from the brand Pomo One. Three dollars off right now. Eleven dollars. The sale ends March twenty fourth. It tastes pretty good. It's like a brown sauce with like beef item. I would say I do have one complaint. The beef in there, it's pretty hard i would say it's not as like tender it doesn't have a lot of fat which i think most people like but to me it's a little bit too dry it's a little bit too hard but other than that it, the flavor is really good but it's not a healthy item the ingredients is not super clean who loves chicken katsu i love chicken katsu when i go to japanese restaurants so there's a new item from the brand of flows checkerboard kitchen chicken katsu with tonkamsu sauce $12.89 however however when i was examining the ingredients look palm oil and that's not just it soybean oil but that's not just it there's also corn syrup solids then some gone corn syrup in the tonkamsu sauce ingredients not misming approved not healthy $12.89 new item but not if it's being approved the costco has this kirkland basil pasta sauce as 100 percent imported italian basil it's priced as $9.49 however i probably wouldn't get it the first ingredients is basil blend including sunflower oil sunflower oil then extra virgin olive oil so i was like you have more sunflower oil than extra virgin olive oil. First of all, it will taste better if you just put extra virgin olive oil. All of it has a very nice fragrance to it. Um, second of all, sunflower oil is highly processed, not healthy, high omega-6 and all that good jazz. So I'm gonna put it back. I wish they just put extra virgin olive oil, even if they put like a dollar more, I would just choose to put olive oil, $9.49. So there's this real good chicken pepper jack cheese burritos, $11.99, loaded with chicken breast chunks. And I like most of the real good items, like they usually taste pretty good actually. Oh my gosh, 20 grams of dietary fiber, I love that. So 37 grams of protein. Initially I was like, this is really good macros, but then taking a look, oh my gosh, a vegetable oil may contain soybean and palm oils, may. So what do they put in there? They don't disclose, oh my god. The ingredients is not as clean as I want it to be. I was like, oh, it looks pretty good on the macros, but then the ingredients is not super clean. So um, personal opinion, if you eat it from time to time, it's not bad at all. I probably wouldn't but purchase over and over again. Vegetable oils is okay if you don't over consume it. So I'm gonna try this out. So how do you cook it? So you could either use oven or microwave. So put the burrito in a microwave and the cover with another microwave safe plate completely. Cook for two minutes, then flip, and then cook for another two minutes. And then, pro tip, after the microwave, put the burrito in a frying pan with light spray oil for two to three minutes. All right, guys, I already removed the burrito from the package. This is what it looks like. And it says to put another plate on top and microwave like this. Let's do it. So I just microwave it for two minutes, and I was taking it out to flip it for another two minutes. 
but look it already like poached out so it's actually really hot i think the internal temperature is really really hot after the first two minutes so i don't think i need to flip and then do another two minutes because i think it's because like it tells me to cover it with a plate or something so i don't know what to do honestly the cheese actually already squeezed out all right let's try it so i'm gonna coat the pan to low heat this is my new pan from henkel's ah, there we go Look, it leaked! Cheese on top, just make sure it's not stuck. It's non stick pan. Do you think we can flip? It's definitely a non stick pan. I like the pl I like how the pan is super flat, but also a saucepan where, you know, if you want to do like a little stew, like a lot of sauce at the top, bottom, it's okay. It's deep enough. It's a deep pan that's flat. But the pan is truly non-stick. Okay, I think it's good enough. Let's open this burrito. It has like white meat chicken. It smells really, really cheesy. Ooh, a lot of cheese just burst out. I know I'm like destroying this with my fork. I should have used my hands, but I just don't want to make my hands dirty. This is what it looks like. Let's try it. Mmm, I can kind of tell it's low carb. The texture of the wrap is a little bit different, but the cheese make up for it because it's so cheesy. Um, preferably put a little bit of salsa to it. Put some green sauce. I don't have salsa. Some green sauce, green spicy, green dragon hot sauce from Trader Joe's, which it make it taste really, really good. So if you like those panko shrimp, it's also on sale $4 off, right now $15. Let's take a look at ingredients. Let's take a look. Shrimp, wheat flour, soybean oil. Most of these shrimp items have soybean oil. I don't know why. Maybe just because soybean oil is so cheap. So the soybean oil is super high in omega-6. So I'll probably skip this item. Since I already bought something with vegetable oil, I'm just going to skip so that I can eat things in moderation. It's $15. $4 off after the sale. The sale ends March 31st. So it's not healthy, especially it's breaded shrimp. I would just eat normal shrimp on its own. It's this butter parmesan alaska cod 1879 let's take a let's take a look at the ingredients it's alaska cod water olive oil canola oil what bad okay the only problem is why would i put canola oil they also put gorgon then i wish they just put olive oil they are sampling the alaska cod i'm super excited let's try this out even though it's not super clean ingredients i wanted to try it Mmm. Really nice flavor, but I think I can make it easy. I can make this easy. You just put butter in there, salt and pepper, a little Parmesan cheese at the top. Perfect. Tastes good, really good flavor, but I think I can make it. Tastes pretty good. The ingredients, not super, not super clean. Only cooked grilled chicken patty is on sale. We're 15 off right now. It's 10.49. Chicken roast without antibiotics and gluten free. It's not organic, but that's fine. It's not free range chicken, but that's fine. But look at ingredients. It's just onions, sugar, salt, spices, and garlic. This is not too bad at all. Like it's way better than I expected. This is actually not a bad item. 450 off is a really good deal. In my last video, I talk about the Ciente Green Free Churro Chips. Churro strips that taste pretty good. I do, do recommend this if you love the churro chips. It's 6.69, but next to it, it's called turtle chips. So this is what it looks like. It's 6.49. Oh, similar price for the brand Orion. Okay, so I was like, let's take a look at ingredients. First of all, it looks super interesting, right? Ooh, cinnamon sugar and chocolate. It has like chocolate churro chips. But first of all, product name, turtle chips choco, choco churros, artificially flavored. What does it say? Artificially flavored. So it has vegetable oils and stuff, high fat powder and stuff, ripsy oil. Palm oil. So this one is the opposite of Siente. It's like Siente is healthy. This one, it looks so interesting and yummy, but artificially flavored. So we're gonna put it back. Okay, this is another one of my guilty pleasure, I have to admit. I try not to eat this. I try not to buy it all the time. It's the Boon Chica Pop Cattle Porn Sweet and Salty. This one is currently on sale, 230 off right now, 369. Let me tell you why it's not healthy. So first of all, what do you see? Sunflower oil. Second of all, what do you see? Eight grams of added sugar per serving. That's a lot of sugar. <sighs> Should I buy it when it's on sale? 
Should I resist? Comment down below. Do you think I should buy it? I love it, but it's not healthy at all. It's against my own advice. But it's only three sixty nine dollars. Struggle is real. Look into it every day. <laughs> yeah. The safe catch six pack. Three dollars off right now. Ten dollars. Sale ends March seventeenth. Ten dollars. Three dollars off. I'll grab one of those. Okay, this Vietnamese pho is on sale. Wait, they're giving out sample. So it's on sale $3.30 off. Right now it's $8.69 after the sale. And it's at the end of March. So this is what it looks like. The noodle kind of broke down a lot. Flavor-wise, it's really good. It's just the noodle break down a lot. It's really nice pho flavor though. Not healthy. I'm pretty sure it has like flavoring that's questionable I, I think I've seen the ingredients but the texture of the noodle break down a lot it's kind of like not the best texture overcooked almost break down too much stool is edible but not my favorite comment down below what you think it is avocado oil mayo from chosen food is three dollars off rent is six dollars love this one this is the best mayo you can buy True Fruit is back to Costco. My husband loves this. $10.99, actually $9.99. My husband loves this one because it's dark chocolate on the outside and hyper dried fresh um, strawberries in the inside. It still has 13 grams of added sugar. It's a high sugar item for sure. But the ingredients is not too bad at all. Dark chocolate. It does have soy lecithin as like a emulsifier, but other than that, it's not bad. Yep, my husband loves this one. Should I buy it for him? Should I not? Comment down below. Maybe we'll come back to it. So Costco has this Hadar chocolate drizzled coconut macaroons. $10.79 sets. Let's take a look at ingredients. Sulfate-free coconut, invert sugar, tapioca starch, egg white, seven states chocolate. Ooh, super good ingredients. That's pretty good. If you love macaroons, um, it's a high sugar item regardless though. Um, it's not a healthy item, but let's say if you really, really want to eat dessert or if you're buying a dessert for parties, this is a really good one because even though it's like a sugary item, the ingredients are really clean. $10.79 for all of this. This is a lot of macaroons. This aisle has a lot of like Easter chocolate thing. This one looks like an Easter chocolate thing. Chocolate filled bars. It is $13.99. Well, I probably wouldn't buy this even though it has like different fillers and stuff. Sugar, the first ingredient is not chocolate but sugar. Second of all, after chocolate and milk powder, it's vegetable fat. Vegetable fat is okay. It has shea butter, cocoa oil, coconut oil, but then sunflower oil. I want to say this is not super good. This Clinics Lotion Facial Tissue is on sale $5 off right now, $16.49. So if you have allergies, get this one because it has lotion in it. It's super soft and soothing. This is the only one that doesn't irritate my skin. If I use normal Kleenex to save money, like I usually buy these just to save money. I usually have really bad skin irritation around my nose, but these ones are lifesavers. So I'm going to grab myself three of them. I know some probably a little bit overkill, but I need it. All free and clear is on sale. $5 off right now, $15. Sale ends March 31st. This is the only one that I use right now. It's free and clear laundry detergent because now that we have a babe the baby has skin issues so I want to make sure this is hypoallergenic the power mub is on sale it has one device and two solutions and 10 pads it's currently nine dollars off after the sale is thirty dollars the sale ends March 31st so nine dollars off this is thirty dollars so it looks like this this is power mob so it has two of it has two solutions this is a solution one device and then 10 of the pads Okay, I'm gonna grab one, $30. So the Tide Pots is actually on sale. This is the free and gentle one. Nice, those are clear and probably fragrance-free. I bought an organic, $6 off. Right now, $23.69. Those are the Pots ones, not the liquid ones, but it's pretty much the same as the um, free and clear. I love using Clorox to sanitize. This one is on sale $3.80 off. Right now, it's $15. The sale ends at the end of the March. So all of these cleaning supplies are actually some on sale. These Swiffer dust things is $4 off right now, $13.89. So ends at the end of the month. So I have these heavy duty dry cloths, $4 off, $13.99 after the sale. 
The food saver is also on sale. We actually have one too. It's currently $25 off. It's $75 after the deal. So it ends March 31st. All right, so if you need ice maker, we have two kind. This is the smaller one, but this one is $80. It's cheaper than Sam's Club. This is similar to the one that we have, or if you want a more heavy duty one. From the same brand, we have the gallery version of this. This is way bigger. It's $219. I wonder if it's gonna be on sale in the future, but this one is for 44 pounds of ice capacity versus this one is for 26 pounds. Pretty much like two of this combined. So this one is $219. The Oral-B toothbrush is on sale. It's very similar to the one that I had. It's a different model. Mine lasted for two years and then the battery died on me. Um, my husband's one was still okay. I had the white one and he used this the black one, but he's still works, but mine for some reason the battery died. So I used this one for two years. So it's on sale $50 off. Right now $120. The sale ends. March 31st. These bath towels on, on sale, $2 off. After the sale is $7. The deal expires March 10th. Um, Brandon wanted to get new towels last time, so we're gonna get some different colors from the ones that we have. I think the green one looks pretty good. $7 is a pretty good deal. It's really soft. 100% cotton bath towels. This is actually really fancy looking compared to the ones that I got from Timu. Definitely looks more fancy. So four piece, ten dollars off right now. Twenty seven dollars. Deal ends at the end of March. Ten dollars off for four of these. Looks pretty good quality. Looks like fancier than the ones from Amazon or Timu. Definitely, I think higher quality. The batteries are on sale again. Two dollars off for all of the batteries from this brand. I was a problem to say this brand Doracell. <laughs> so all of their batteries are on sale. Two dollars off. Um, different pricing after the sale, and the sale ends on March 31st. So there are several skincare items I saw on sale. And this one is a Neutrogena Retinol Regenerative Cream. It's fragrance free. This one is really, really good retinol. It's currently on sale $10 off, right now $30. So don't use it when you're pregnant or nursing. So I personally cannot use it because I'm nursing. But this is the only one that dermatologists that they recommend because there's a fragrance free, no parabens, no dyes, no mineral oils. It's a really good, really good item. Only $30. $30 for two retinol creams is a really good price. Highly recommend. Oh my gosh, at a kid's toy section. I didn't know there was a section, but this is for your backyard if you have kids. This one, the Ring Shower Flow Water Tape, $70. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. And they have this size with the house. Classic Coaster Extreme. Wow. So you can have this one. It's like a stairs thing. You put a little cart and you just go from there. It's $250. This one, the Outdoor Playhouse. Wow. Is $379. This is what it looks like. So this is the outdoor playhouse. This is the slides and that is the station, the water station. Finally, this is the swing set with the slides. This is what it looks like. Oh my gosh, that's so fancy. Guess what? A thousand two hundred dollars. And this is what it looks like. It's so huge. So this is a hundred a thousand two hundred dollars with the swing with the slides and this is the kids' house for $350. This is the slice for $250. And at the very end, we have the water table for $70. So this whole thing you can get take it home. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, more squishmallows at the Costco. Look at this cinnamon squishmallows. It's so cute. His name is Hot. $14 for this is a really good price. If you go to normal stores, it would have it would have paid like charge like $25 or more. And then this ones, the huge ones are $28.99. So $29 for this huge squishmallows. My my baby loves squishmallows. Look at this little duck. Eee, so cute. Alrighty, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for shopping with me at Costco, checking out the deals and new items here. If you have any recommendations, comment down below. And I will see you in my next video. Thumbs up and subscribe. Bye.